And what's brought me here with you is learning the technical side of cryptocurrency because I'm not a technical investor. You know, when it comes to the charts and doing all that kind of stuff, I'm a fish out of water, man. I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I just, uh, I never learned it. It was, it's a skill set that I, I'm looking to, to understand a little bit better. Um, where my strengths lie is in finding trends early. Mm-hmm. And one of those mm-hmm. trends early uh, was Hex. And I, the first time I bought Hex was after the big payday dip. And I had been watching it through other influencers and uh, social media. And I didn't, I didn't fully understand it because there was a lot of moving pieces. You had the staking aspect, you had the, the T-share aspect, mm-hmm. then you had the crypto actually going up and down mm-hmm. aspect. Uh, and then you have Richard Hart, who is just, you know, a whole character in himself that you need to understand. <laughs> right. And then there's, there's so much game theory to it and it's fun. And I love the challenge. And I think as an entrepreneur, we, we love that, right? And we love the game. You know, I, I love the game, man, whether it's 100%. crypto, whether it's building a business, you know, helping people, online courses, writing a book, whatever it might be. I love the games. And um, because I love the games, I, I just fell in love with Hex. And as soon as it was down 70 or 80 percent, I remember Richard saying in one of the uh, talks where he's like, oh, I don't know what was going to happen after, you know, this big payday thing. But in my mind, everyone kind of knew it was going to dump. Right. Everyone got this free money. What are you going to do with it? You're going to sell it, man. You're going to take your profits. And so it went down a lot. Mm-hmm. And that's the first time I bought Hex. And my intuition, and looking at it now, is, you know, well, who knows, who knows what will happen with Hex in the future, but I bought it for fractions of fractions of a penny. Um, my first intuition was, wow, it's down 80%, 70%. Buy it. You know, like I was like, buy the darn thing. You know, like this is the time to buy is when it's in the red. You know, you buy the red, you sell the green. Mm-hmm. And um, I remember I bought it. I didn't full, like, you know, full go all into it, but I bought a, a decent, you know, amount of money with it. And then uh, it kept dipping. And I was like, oh, gosh, you know, that's the worst feeling in the world. You know what I mean? When you buy something and then it just keeps going down, but it dipped right, a little bit more. Right. And then I was like, all right, I'll, I'll buy a little bit more. Like, okay. <laughs> you know, like I'm in this far, right? Like I might as well, you know, buy some more of it. Like if, if, if my theory is right about why I'm actually buying this, it's going to pay off. And so... I kept buying it and then I just kept buying it and buying it and buying it. And Hex is my number two holding right now after uh, Polygon Matic. And Polygon Matic, I bought at a penny. They're both so, killing it. Yeah, I'm, t- dude, I'm telling you, Polygon has done like 250X for me. Mm-hmm. Hex has done not 250X, but it's, it's, it's a lot. <laughs> um, so mm-hmm. between those two, those are my two biggest holdings. And I've diamond handed uh, both of them, man. Honestly, that's why I wear the shirt. It says, just hodl it. And that's what I wear in every single one of my videos because I am a, I'm a big believer in that. Truly, I really, truly am. And, and Richard tells us that all the time. He's like, who wins at the game of crypto? Founders and holders. That's it. And it's like, why go against the grain? Go look at the results of all of that. And so uh, that's kind of my story, man.